recording. Hey guys, so we're doing a uh, another Q and A session with my friend Nicole. Um, she's a recent college graduate. Where where did you graduate from, Nicole? Oh, uh, Southern Methodist University. So SMU, where all the really rich people go, right? <laughs> okay. Well, not not all of them are rich. I mean, I'm pretty broke as hell right no, now. No, you can't say it. you're you're definitely not like you're definitely top ten percentile, oh, Nicole. You can't say that. Do you do you have a lake house? <laughs> okay, I, I don't I don't own it, but But whatever. So your family has a lake house, so let's just say you're upper middle class. Anyways, let's um the so uh, to give more background too, you were a business major, correct? At SMU? Yeah. Okay, so uh, like, tell me about your background too. So you obviously got your business degree, and then I know you worked in LA for a little bit, right? Yeah, I worked with a producer while I was living there for about a year. Uh, so basically, I helped him launch a cosmetic brand as well because he owned his own little brand consulting image firm. So that was interesting. Okay, and then uh, um, yeah. you also right now you're looking for work in the tech field, right? Like, aren't most of your jobs tech related or? All of them are. So I've been. I moved back to Texas. So San Antonio, the by I'm the way, guys. <laughs> Go ahead. I'm sorry. What? I was just saying that you're from San Antonio because you said Texas, but I was. Oh yeah, yeah. Go Spurs. Yeah. Well, Go Spurs. Yeah, yeah, she's a Spurs fan. Yeah. But anyways, as I was saying, um, yeah, no, the city I'm working in right now, it's there's so many big tech industry firms out there. So I've just been nonstop applying to a lot of them. But so far, no luck right now. But maybe that'll change in the next month or two. All right. And so I convinced you to come on here because I know you obviously have a business background and you're obviously curious about real estate, investing, cryptocurrency. So we were going to do this on crypto. Um, and we'll probably start another video because of this, this video clip. I'm just going to only do your background. Um, so is there anything else? You're obviously a sports fan. You studied business. Is there anything else that we need to add on this? minute like we can go for like one more minute and then we'll ma we'll make another segment that we go over the crypto stuff and the real estate stuff will be another video anything else no i mean no that's just basically the gist of what i do or who i am um, okay and then just really quick have you ever owned a stock or you obviously don't own any real estate but you, have you ever purchased a stock didn't i make you go on robin hood yeah <laughs> yeah you actually yeah i think technically i have that robin hood app so you own one own. stock what stock did you get on robin hood uh let me check actually I don't know. <laughs> so guys honestly, if, if you so while she's check checking if, if you guys haven't at the bottom of this video there's a link to the robin hood and i highly recommend if you do click on that link um you know, I, I also get a free stock and obviously Nicole can vouch for me that she got a free stock off of me. And I think that's really important that you guys do get that Robinhood account because it'll allow you to not only buy cryptocurrencies, but you can also buy stocks. And then Nicole, I don't know if you know this, but you know, Robinhood is now paying 3% interest. They have a checking account. Yeah, it, it's telling me that. So yeah, it tells so, me I have- so Wells Fargo. Yeah, if you bank with like Wells Fargo, Citibank, any major bank, they give you zero. So if you put $1,000 there, they give you $0 of interest. With Robinhood, every $1,000 you put in now, they'll give you $3 of interest, which is better than nothing. And obviously, if you're a baller and you have $100,000, that means they give you $3,000 a year for leaving your money in their account, which is still better than nothing. But, yeah, very true, very true. Okay, cool. So I'm going to go ahead and stop this. We'll go and start another segment on the investing stuff. So uh, say bye to the audience. Bye, guys.